Sheikh's Parsha has the infamous story of the spies. And Hashem said, I'm going to take you to the land of Israel, most beautiful, magnificent place. And the Jews said, we're going to send spies to check it out, which was a bad idea because Hashem said it's great. And they say, we'll check it out. That was just, by the way, a good lesson for us. If Hashem says it's good, then don't ask questions. But they went on and they saw the place and they came back and they said, yeah, it's a beautiful place, but however, and they had some bad things to say about it too. And what did they say? One of the things they said was we saw there the giants and the Torah says there were four giants, huge, giant, humongous people. They were walking around there and they said, we felt so small. They looked at us as if we're ants and we felt so small in their eyes. And that's the problem. What's so bad about that? Where did they go wrong? You see, if someone looks at you a certain way, they can do whatever they want. People can look at you a certain way, but they added, and we felt so small in their eyes. Why do you have to feel so small if they think you're small? Stop thinking what other people are thinking. Do what you got to do. The bigger picture was, they're going into Israel, and they're going to be this, you know, cult-like, so to speak. We're different, we're Jewish, we have our laws. And what are people going to say? That was the problem. It's better to live in the desert with the only people around. Everyone keeps the Torah. That's what we want. But we're going to go into the land of Israel where other people are there? And they're going to look at us differently? How will we feel? That's the mistake. Friends, please remember. If Hashem says it's good, then it's awesome, it's great. And more than that, if this is what you got to do, forget about what people will think. Let them think, why do you have to feel the way they look at you? This is the right thing to do, and this is what I'm going to do, no matter what other people say. That's the lesson we have to learn from this week's Parsha. Thank you and good Shabbos from the traveling Hasidim. And once again, we're looking forward to a wonderful Shabbos in Margate City, our third time going. We're very much looking forward to good Shabbos.